Now here it is important not to over trim the abutment just to get the casting in. So the best thing to do now doctor which you are not doing is if this doesn't go it is better to just cut the frame in two pieces. Okay which I will show you. Open. And you start, any one of you who is doing basal implants watching this video, just start doing this step which I am just telling you right now instead of milling endlessly. Now just sit, uh, just one of you go there and just mill this. We will cut the frame into two pieces in the center. Okay? Doctor, okay? Which has been already done for me by my associate doctor. Okay. Can you see? Another thing is, after the cutting, sometimes if you see, the frame is not as retentive as it was before. In that case, just give me fix on gel uh, and uh, glass slab. Use fix on and use LA gel. Okay, fix on and LA gel. Can you fix on it? See, just for the video here, please. Use fix on and use your LA gel and mix it. Give me one probe. Mix it like a cement and use it inside your prosthesis. Okay, and then you just use this inside your prosthesis so that the prosthesis doesn't keep floating in the mouth while you are working and what how this now this step is we are doing right now but when the lab guy is going to solder the prosthesis and refire it because of the shrinkage this problem will get solved okay Important thing is to get good margins rather than get this thing in. Okay, so now when it goes in the patient's mouth, you will see that I have a stable environment to work with. Yeah, good. Okay, now this is absolutely stable. Okay, and I will do, now this side doesn't need it. So now I will show you the second, st I think one second. Just give me a metal cutting board. Okay, and now what I will do is open here, open. Good, much better than before. Now I will use a pattern resin and join these two frames. Just give me a mouth. Here. Give me pattern resin. Done. Dr. Mom, thank you so much. So meanwhile, I just put fix on it. I just check for this one also. Mokale, mokale, I think. See now. Are you able to appreciate the difference? Otherwise, I would have kept milling the implants, which you are doing, sir. See this. Okay, so these are very small small things but they do matter a lot in the long run. See how nicely it is fitting. Okay, so now I am going to use pattern resin. Open this, 
गिव मी सम पैटर्न रेजिंग प्रोजेक्ट है ये इधर आ जाए इधर पीछे आ जाओ मैडम जी एंड गिव मी द लिक्विड एंड टिश्यू पेपर प्लीज एंड मिक्स इट ओके एंड मिक्स दिस डॉक्टर प्लीज रिक्वेस्ट यू टू होल्ड ऑन वील डिस्कस ऑल योर क्वेरी लेटर ओके डॉक्टर्स प्लीज एंड नाउ आई विल यूज माई पैटर्न एज इन टू जॉइन बोथ ऑफ दिस सो दिस ट्रिक यू विल ऑल्सो बी हेल्पफुल इवन इन योर कन्वेंशनल इम्प्लांटोलॉजी रेदर देन स्ट्रगलिंग हंड्रेड टाइम्स इन टेकिंग द इम्प्रेशन you do this and now the lab guy basically please lab guy has to just solder these two things and if you are very concerned you can retry the framework but 9 out of 10 out of 10 times you it will be fine if the soldering has been done properly